Hello Cyber Learners, this is Mohit and today I will show you that how to generate sine wave or cosine wave using MATLAB. So this is my basic MATLAB. First of all let me tell you some commands to clear the command window of a MATLAB. This is my command window where all of these things are written. So I will use CLC. That's my clear command. To clear my workspace, I will type clear all. If anything around here on my workspace is my workspace, then that will get cleared. I will use a close all command to close any kind of simulation like graphs or something else which is running behind the MATLAB. Okay, now for a sine wave or cosine wave, let me start. I will use a basic equation that is y equals to a star sine 2 pi f t and similarly y equals to a star cos 2 pi f t where t is my time period this will be my time period f will be my frequency pi is basic pi pi equals to uh, let me write it here pi equals to 3.14 or something else and a is my amplitude of the wave so let's start first of all i will give a time period which will initiate from 0 and at 2 and will contain the steps of 0 0.01 uh, you can change these steps to 0 0.001, 0 0.1 to check out that what happens when you change these steps. Try it guys, that's funny. Okay. Now I will give a frequency f equals to 2, amplitude a equals to 1. And I will write my wave equation y equals to a sine 2 into f in, or pi into f into t okay. then i will write a subplot of 2 1 1 and that's my subplot then i will give a plot of t y okay so here we can see that there is a nice sign wave using my wave theorem okay now if I want to plot a continuous cosine wave then I will use the same things just I use here t is equals to 0 0.012 and frequency will be equals to 2 a amplitude will be equals to 1 y will be equals to a star cos 2 by f t so as you can see that as when we were plotting sine waves we use sine when we are plotting cos waves we use cos MATLAB determines them automatically and now I will use subplot 2 1 2 ok uh, you will see that this 2 and this one this one generates my plot at first half of the plane and this 2 will generate it at second half of the plane on the z axis I'm not using y-axis, not using x-axis, I'm using z-axis, okay. And I'll type plot t, y. So, here we go. There's a nice cosine wave. As you can see, I'll make it green or something else like that. Oh, I'm sorry, I want that delete. So here's my wave. I can change it color, but I don't remember that how to do it. Okay, that's all. Thank you for watching. Subscribe my channel.